Starting in the foothills of the magical Blue Ridge Mountains at the confluence of the Jackson and Calpasture Rivers, the James River begins its winding journey to the Chesapeake Bay. Over 340 miles, it weaves through forests, farmland, cities, towns, fed by an additional 15,000 miles of streams and creeks that make up its tributaries. The James serves more than three million people in its watershed, providing drinking water for humans, animals, cooling currents for river lovers and recreationists, and the beauty and solace of waterfront views for those who live and work near its banks. While the James River has slowly improved since the passage of important legislation and dedicated restoration efforts, it still faces significant threats from polluted urban and agricultural runoff. Excess nutrient and sediment loading, as well as high levels of bacteria, jeopardize the health of the James and its inhabitants. Luckily, there's a solution. By building riparian buffers across the watershed, we can heal the James and foster the diverse network of life it supports. A riparian forest buffer is an area adjacent to a stream, lake, or wetland that contains a combination of trees, shrubs, and or other perennial plants and is managed differently from the surrounding landscape, primarily to provide conservation benefits. So there are many functions of a riparian buffer that cross over and can benefit the landowner. Starting with the roots holding the stream bank and stabilizing it, the buffer also filters out the sediment and the nutrients getting into your waterway so it can clear up the water and the clarity of the water. From a wildlife perspective, the riparian buffer can benefit the, the waterways by shading it and cooling it for the aquatic life. Um, other wildlife benefits include the pollinator habitat, so if you have fruit or vegetable production farms that'll help with that. Also another future benefit of our riparian buffer project is creating those uh, shaded trail systems right along the waterway where you can hike, picnic, or trail ride. Depending on the species planted, you could have harvestable products such as fruits, nuts, berries, or cut flower arrangements. Through the James River Buffer Program, the James River Association, the Virginia Department of Forestry, and the Chesapeake Bay Foundation are working with folks throughout the upper and middle James watersheds to restore or create forest buffers that improve the quality of our local waterways. This program is open to anyone in the upper and middle James watershed that wants to improve water quality and habitat, has water on their property in need of a streamside forest, and that agrees to keep the area forested for 15 years. We are connected to the James because we live in the James River watershed. Even someone with the smallest buffer creek contributes to the overall impact. By stepping up to restore your streamside forest, you become part of the James River watershed patchwork quilt that connects us all. Thanks to funding by the Virginia Environmental Endowment, the James River Buffer Program covers 100% of the project costs from site preparation, installation, and three years of establishment support. For more information and to apply, visit www.jamesriverbuffers.org and join us in planting trees for a healthy James River.